Hickory beep beep. Hickory beep beep. beautiful gothic florin and if you can see look digsters with me as well so i think the digsters brought me look because i've just dug one hole and um i'll show you what i can see in exciting i hope it is right i'll show you where you're, you're looking can you see i think that's a little silver i do think it's a little silver let's see if i can poke it out a little bit Pokey pokey, piggy the pokey. Pokey hokey, piggy the pokey. Uh, oh, I don't know, it seems to be silvery on the edge. There, it's got to be silver because look, there's a little silver bit on that edge. I'm going to have to have a bit of tin foil off it off. Oh, look at these here now because the butties are out. I'm going to have to use a bit of tin foil. <laughs> well, I watch it. If, you know what he does? He nicks them out of your bag. I'm going to have to uh, just sit on the grass here. And I'm going to have to try and just give this a clean with the tin foil. Or just to see if it's silver anyway. Because I can see something. Put that on there. Give it a bit of a rub. Yep, it's definitely silver. It's because it, when you when you rub silver, if you're not sure, it smells like bad eggs. So I'm just seeing if I can rub somebody's head there. Yeah, give it a bit of a rub. See what I can find. It's a good way of cleaning silver. This with a bit of tin foil. Hey, it feels a silver in my first hole. Don't matter if you don't know what it is, does it? Hey, <laughs> let's have a look. See if we can. You see already a bit of it's coming up. Right, so we've got to say, I've got no idea what that is till I get home and give it a bit of a boil. But um, it's silver, 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 silver. Silver Diggy, are you good luck? Are you Mr. Good Luck? Look, Diggy, look, sniff that. Sniff it. No, not eat it. Sniff it. Go find it. Go find it. He's only after butties and crisps. It's a Vicky. So I think it's a little Vicky Threepence. The back of it's well crusted on with something. I'll have to give that a bit of a boil with bicarbonate soda when I get home. Hoo -hoo -hoo, first doll. I'm a silver machine, aren't I? It was a bit scrappy that signal as well. It was like a 70s and then it was going to 60s a bit, but hey. <laughs> Diggy, you were supposed to play with that ball. Look, look. Well, signal two's massive, and I couldn't find it. Anyway, it's around there. It's a solid 76 on my detector. It's got a lovely crisp signal. Perhaps a little bit too crispy, if I'm honest. Just have a look at what it could be. Because this is the field I found that, that, that flooring in. And this is a, a bit of a chapel down at the bottom. Oh God, ground rock hard. There it is. What a loud signal! I don't know why signals are so loud. I'm not quite sure what again what it is. Let's have a little. I think it's a George V. It was very loud. That I mean, it was like a can. It was so loud. Diggy, what you got? What you got, Diggy? What's that? Oh, it's a big stick. Oh, that's him happy for day now, a big stick. Are you happy with your big stick? Yep. Yeah. Diggy had dropped his ball, are you? 
and I came over for it. I just was going to go for it. Notice there was a nice signal next to it. I think Diggy might be putting balls on signals. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Let's see what it is. See what we found, Diggy. Can we see what you found? Oh, is that it? Particular what you found? What is it? It's um. It's a charge the third. Get in there and having a look. Yep, another crusty charge the third. <coughs> what is it? What you found that? You buy put your ball on the signal. Well done, digs. Great when you find something in your first hole. Because you're not under any pressure then to find anything because you've already found it, haven't you? Having a great time here, sat with Diggy. He's been such a good boy. And now he's putting balls on signals. How can we <laughs> it's brilliant. I've just got out, so I've just put my coat in the bush. And I've done that. You see, must be having one of them days where it's just like fate's making me do stuff. You've missed digs, it's in the top. Will you dig there? I'll dig there. Seems a bit big to be honest, I think it might be a cow. Cow in the hole, something big. I hope it's an artifact. Not that little thing, is it? No. There it is, there it is. Ooh! Can't wheel penny in the hole! Can't wheel penny in the hole, Diggy! <laughs> is there anything on it though? That's the thing. Oh, Diggy, you're bringing me such good luck today, aren't you? Good boy. He's a good boy, yeah? Can't wheel penny. So that's a little silver, a coin I don't know what it is, and a can't wheel penny. Oh, fantastic. I wonder if we'll be able to see on it, anything on it. Cartwheel Penny is a George the Third, dated 1797, and it was the old penny, and it was one ounce of copper, so they were right, big dobbers. Big dobber means massive. See, last time I was in this field, when I found that florid, I was going up and down like that, and I went up and down like gridded. Well, this time I'm going across, because you can pick up signals going the opposite way. So there could be another florin. Cut the diggy. Diggy lead us to the silver. It's quite good him, you know, because sometimes when he's on his lead, I can't go, because he's on 50 foot lead. Um, and sometimes he goes a certain way and I just follow him. And I used to get good coins doing that, following diggy. You get out of my bag. Don't start all that of me chasing you around after your treats. Leave it. Do I just love days like this when you walk in a field, get a little silver, toodle along with your little lovely dog that you love. And then put your coat somewhere, find a cartwheel penny, and then he puts his ball somewhere and find something else. I think it's a sign, me. It must be one of them days where it's a sign. It's a sign. Can I just say, Diggy's not responsible for felling that tree. <laughs> uh, anyway, I've just come here, got a lovely 84 signal. So I'm thinking it might be another copper. Right, whatever it is. Oh, what are you? Oh, bit of pottery. Bit of pottery. What is it, Diggy? What's it? Move, you move. Can't see. Oh, 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 there it is. And it is a 2p. <laughs> 2p in the hole. Oh! 
I don't believe it. I don't believe it. Tiki, look. Look, Tiki. Oh, it's a bit rotted. Get out of my bag. Trying to dig all silvers and a dog in my bag trying to rob his treats. Oh, what is it? Oh, they're a bit crusty, these ones, this week. Oh, uh, can't even tell. Oh, come on, are we going to get my tinfoil out again? Yeah, try my glasses first. Oh, what a superb day. Oh, I'm well chuffed. Proper chuffed. Dicky, you're, you're coming every week from now on. Every old brilliant near him. A lot of them are near his ball. What is it? What is it? <laughs> what are you? Better get the tinfoil out again. Are you ready to see what it is, Diggy? I've rubbed it with tinfoil. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Oh, yeah! Look, he's a big old George Third Bullhead. Sixpence. Stunk that when he did it. Oh, fantastic! Oh, fantastic! You see? You only need to find the right field. That's all you need to find. This field's popping them out left, right and centre. But that's because it's right next behind some houses that are not there anymore. And in front of a chapel that's not there anymore. But I found it on that little map. Oh, that's mega. Look, it looks in good condition and all, doesn't it? Oh, that's absolutely tops. Top, top. Date on that will be between about 18... 15, 18, 19, somewhere like that. Oh, love it, love it, love it. Well chuffed with that, proper well chuffed. Proper, proper chuffed. I've been looking at that with my gigs on. He's absolutely in top condition. You can even see his ear. Look, can you see his ear? Oh, that's fab. Fab, 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 fab. I'm staining all these little reedy bushy things because going around these now, I've, I've just found a few things. Oh, I'm well chuffed with that bullhead. Absolutely, it was in mega condition. It was quite high that. Do you know what? I've got a feeling that's cartwheel. <laughs> Let's see. Diggy, get out. Oh, look. He's stealing out of my bag. Get, get your little head out of my bag. Oh, Dick, get out. Could have to lock that. Nothing safe with him around. Let's see what's in this one then. I should be so lucky, lucky, look. Come on, out of the way. Come on, out of the way. there whatever it is come on a bit more silver a bit more silver oh oh gee oh i'm laughing whoa right 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 oh we can't sit down it's full of thistles if you hear me say now it's because i've sat on a nettle there it is there anything's in these bushes is it a copper i thought it was going to be a to be honest, I thought it was going to be a cartwheel because of the how high the signal was. Let's have a look, what are you? Ooh. I think it's just a big, a big massive George Third uh, copper penny. We still got writing on it. Ooh. Now this week I got sent some um, preservation wax called Traporius Wax. Show you a picture of it. Now I was really glad I got sent this because um, I had sort of pot and then diggy chewed the pot up. And but it really preserves your coins. And I'm going to put some on this one and see what detail it brings out because it brings out really loads of detail. I'll put a link in the description at the bottom in case if you want to buy any. But yeah, Traborius wax should bring that up. Or it'll get the writing on it anyway. Right, something big and loud here. It's very loud, it might be a cartwheel that. Cartwheel in the... Oh. 
Oh, it's a bit funny, the grass round here. Did he move? Oh, he's doing a bit of digging for me. You doing digging? Shift out then, go over there. Can't find it. I think it's just going to be a bit of a nail or something. I'm living in hope now, everything's charged third silver. Dickie, you'll have to move. You're lovely and all that, but you're a bit of a pain when I'm trying to find a signal. Can you move? Move, go on, that way. Go that way. That's it. Oh, it does listen sometimes. Not very often. Oh, I think that's it. There it is. There it is. And it is. Oh, George the Six, you get a right mix of age in this field, don't you? Proper mix of age. So George the Six, in quite good condition really for him because when the metal was made with George the Six, it was gone a bit rubbish by then, but oh, excellent. He'll clean up quite nice, him. Queen of Silver, I think I really am. I'm not, in fact, I'm out today, I've had, on this field, there's not that many signals, but when there is one, it's a good one. So, <laughs> oh, oh, fly. Right, another 78. I'm getting bit to death by horse flies. Dickie, yeah, you're getting a bit by horse flies. Oh, he's having a right good time. Anyway, 78 in the hole here. So. But... <laughs> Who's that? It's another one. Oh wow! Tiki, Tiki, look! You're a silver little. I can't even say it. Your little silver thing. There's that one. I can see him today. He's George the Fifth. George the Fifth. Sixpence. And I think from. Oh, oh sorry. It's, oh, yeah, arse flies. I think he's back praying 1920 because of the back. Oh, fantastic. Oh. oh, this is bad. I don't think I can stay here much longer. Although I'm not, I don't want to go home. Come on, maybe more. More, more. Ground's so dry. Nope, that's it. <laughs> number three, number three, number three, number three. It's round, it's round, I found it in the ground, number three, number three. <laughs> I've decided to come on my bit of plough bit, because it's been rolled now as well, because I couldn't do it last time, because it was too, um, allergies weren't it? This is my first, oh, oh, that's a nice old buckle. That is an old buckle, that is. Oh, what a shame, there's a bit of it missing. Oh. That would have been a shoe buckle probably from about the 1700s or something like that. Oh, we see, proper plough. My first signal on the plough. Dead old shoe buckle. Oh, yeah, I like that. Yeah, I do. Got another nice little signal on this bit of plough. Oh, I wonder what it's going to be. What are you going to be? There it is. There it is. Oops. Oops, oops, oops. Uh, I think it's a George III. Oh, it's nice, this little ploughy bit. Apart from every time I bent down, bend over, I'm getting face battered by horse flies and my background sack by a, a rabid dog. Look at this, look at this, look at this. It looks like a glint of gold. And there's a ringy thing on it. Oh, where is it? What is, what is it? It's a brooch or something. Oh, it's a Saint Christopher. It's not gold though, it's not heavy enough. Oh, what a shame. What's on the back? Looks like an American car. Oh, mind you, silver sometimes goes gold coloured. 
I've seen it go gold before. That half a crown I found was like a gold colour. I wonder if it's silver. Oh, that'd be mega, wouldn't it, if it was silver? Four silvers in one day. I have to go home and lie down. <laughs> Ow, arse fly on my face. Obviously, I've had to put long sleeves on to just stop being bit. Oh, I love that. What a shame it ain't gold. That's where someone's lost it off that, haven't they? Oh, yeah, I love that. What an absolutely fantastic day. Can you believe it? I'm, I'm going to have to cut the day short a bit because I'm getting battered by horse flies and I don't want to keep digging out too long in the heat. But I'm absolutely chuffed a bit so I can't wait to get home and clean them coin. I think a couple of them will need boiling um, in, in bicarbonate of soda just to get the muck off. Oh, fantastic! Fantastic! I'm absolutely chuffed a bit. <laughs> I've only got another two weeks and then I'm off for the summer as well. That's going to be good, especially now I've got fields like this. You see, it's all about the research. If you find the research and you find where the people are, then you'll find where the money is. And that's exactly what's happened, I'm glad to say. So I'm, I'm leaving what else is in there for another day. <laughs> so until next time then, diggity dig dig dig, be lucky. Mm -hmm.